Hello everybody, this is Shrek. So today I'm going to talk about Next.js 13. After the launch of Next.js 13, it has some new techniques of uh, making our code faster or um, whatever they say. Like uh, it, ha it, they are using app router instead of pages. Um, they are still using the pages router, but they made some changes in code. Like we do can't use Next router from the Next slash router we have to use it from the next navigation and and other thing other things in code changes so what is happening currently now is that the old code like uh, react adsense or next.js adsense does not work uh, with the google ad unit as a for making it work i have tried some different type of codes in one part and uh, I'm after making multiple trial and error I have created this package okay uh, you just have to add this part of script tag in your head of your root layout file which may be layout.tsx, jsx, js or ts whatever you prefer and uh, and from google you may got this three part google adsense add unit code uh, which may also called as uh, manual add units the script part then the ins part then the second script part we just have to ignore the first and the second script part and just focus on the ins script and add, uh, change this ins script to jsx part style typing and add it under the google add unit component which may be imported from nextjs 13 underscore google adson underscore adsense there are no minus symbols only in the underscore symbols and uh, if you think that it may have some issues or uh, you are not able to use it just go to google uh, just go to github and raise the issue at here and uh, or otherwise just mail me or send a uh, send a link on discord or whatever you prefer uh, i will just show you the code if you like uh, just go to it src and then the google adsense here you can see the code is used client client component and i have imported two new components like use path name and use search params from next navigation instead of next router okay and I have used them to run the third the, the second part of the script okay what does it do is loads the script part after the children uh, okay that's the point if you think any type of issue I just raise it right here 